That leads us to our next story coming out of Grapevine tonight as we had a road that actually buckled, possibly due to the heat and humidity. That's where we find our very own Todd Unger with the latest, Todd. Hey, Colleen, yeah, until a few hours ago, these barriers were actually blocking Bass Pro Drive over 121 here. As you mentioned, tech stock crews think this was because of the heat. The good news tonight, this is back open, but let's go to some Twitter video. Grapevine police really getting the ball rolling on fixing this by putting out this video last night. It basically shows motorists here almost getting air at this spot where the road was buckling. It took a full day on this Memorial Day holiday, but sure enough, the crews got out here this morning, fixed the out eastbound lanes. Bass Pro Drive reopened about 515 this evening, and a couple of workers here on site tell us they think the big factor in all this was the heat and humidity. Saturday and Sunday, like you mentioned, were real scorchers out here, especially up towards the airport in the Grapevine area. Good news is that it'll be back open by that 6 a.m., 7 a.m. morning rush tomorrow. And as you talked about, the temperatures increasing all week long here. No doubt first responders as well as construction crews are going to be keeping an eye on this kind of thing all week long. Colleen, we'll send it back to you. I know, man, Todd, the heat doesn't just affect us, also affects the roads here in North Texas. And, you know, when we live in North Texas, you sign up for the heat, but this is coming over a month early, as I do have triple digits in the forecast. Not tomorrow, though. We top out around 97 degrees, but coming up, we got to talk about the heat and humidity. Also, those triple digits and Alberta, which is now a subtropical depression, it's actually aiding in these warm temperatures here in North Texas. I'll talk about how that 10-day forecast coming up, John.